right guys well we've made it out here to one of our local lakes today i'd say late fall we're getting into winter time now so the temperatures are dropping uh, we're at like 49 50 degree water temps uh, the air temperature is probably in the 40s right now but it's supposed to get up to like the mid 60s today so really 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 nice day to be on the water uh, super clear and we're gonna see if we can find a few bass we're gonna work uh, probably about two and a half three miles down the lake and then work our way back got a, got a little spot in mind I want to get to creek flowing in I'm gonna see if those fish will be kind of stacked up in there now let's see if we can get one off this big bluff wall here I feel like we can I hope we can hopefully we'll find a nice little school of smallies or something piled up on this thing Small mouth. Good one too. That's what I was hoping for. On the net. Not a very big one, but I'll take it. A little smally. Not too bad. First fish. Travis just caught a spot, so we're three fish for the day total. My first fish, so. Let it go. So we're sitting in 20 foot of water, so that's, I'm throwing the Ned because that thing gets down there really quick, really fast. And there's just something about it that these bass really like, so. We might get lucky and catch us a good one. They're on this wild, bro. Fish it slow. Yeah. So, so I can get down there deeper, but they're definitely on this wall. I just lost one, and then this is the second one I've got into the kayak. Yeah, both of them were smallmouth. All right, guys, number two. Another smallie. About a little bit fatter than the other one. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful fish. There we go. Nice smaller. Oh, I just have one on. You got it. You come back and got it. Oh, that's a good one. He is mad. Oh, 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 buddy. Third smallmouth, guys, off this wall. So, we're definitely in here. Not a bad one either. Barely. Look how I had this fish hooked. Look at his lip. Right in the tip of the lip is how I hooked that fish. Crazy. On that net, I forget the color of that, but it's got white and 
little bit of green pumpkin on the back side. I'll look here in a little bit. I still got the pack, but third small mouth off this wall. About the same size. Heck yeah. That's what you want right there, guys. Let's come out here and have a little fun, catch a few fish. Yes, sir. Let him go. Thanks for playing. Where we started up that way is probably our best bet. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. I'm going to paddle on up to the bluff there and start working my way back. All right, let's catch some more smallmouth off this wall. Large mouth. Short little fat largey. Tiny little dude. Fat though. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Let him go. See you, buddy. I'm gonna go ahead and jump over here. I caught one more up through there. That was it. A little large mouth. All right, I'm going to jump over here and see what happens. We've got two more bluff walls we can hit, though. If we can find them on these like we did this, we'll be in good shape. All right, so we've made it back up the lake. And we're going to kind of run off what we did back there. We're going to hit this bluff wall. Uh, it's not as like big of a bluff, but it's still pretty deep. It's like 20 foot deep, 19, 20 foot deep. So if those smallmouth are sitting on that wall, I'm hoping we can find some stationed up and sitting on this one as well. So I guess we'll see. Woo! Get a little paddle against the wind and the current. Let's drop our transducer bait down in the water here. Let's see where we're at. I know there's a pile of rocks right here on this corner. It's almost a point. I'm gonna throw this Ned rig down there and drag it around. So now we're 19 foot. We were just in 30. We've got on these rocks to come up a little bit. be a good fish right there. Oh, it is. Yep. The biggest one of the day right there, baby. Just like I thought, right off them rocks. Oh, God. Wait. Get out of my drive. Get out of my drive. That's a good one right there, guys. That one got wet. <laughs> That's a good fish right there. Right off them rocks, just like I thought. There we go. Now that's a good one. It's not bad. That's the best of the day, for sure. Right there. See how long it is. There may be some more right there, too. 17, 17 inches. 17. Let him go. There he is, guys. Nice Molly. Let's let that old boy go. And he's gone. I think I fished this river on the way out. There's a lot of grass. You did? I seen you, yeah. 
You missed that 17 incher though. <laughs> you left, you. Oh. Oh, goodness gracious. I thought that was a big and bull the way it hit it. <laughs> Throwing that, the big TRD. It's like a, I can't remember the color. Another smolly. Yeah, mine's like kind of white on one side and uh, it's like a pearl and then it's got green pumpkin on the other side. I'm telling you, if we sit in these little holes long enough, we'll catch some fish. Like right where you're at, where I'm at, these little deep holes and just let it marinate, we're liable to pull multiple fish out of them. It's hard for me to do that though because I'm always on the move. I'm always just going. It's all right. I'll take it. That little dude, at, dude, I thought I had a five pounder on the way he hit that thing. He absolutely just boom. Large mouth. Yeah, large mouth. Oh. Gotcha, bud. Large mouth. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. A large mouth. I don't care what anybody says. I like catching them on a Ned rig. It's fun. Yeah, that's a good one. Oh, there's a good one. Get out of that tree, get out of that tree. Just a largey, another large mouth. It's pretty strong. It's been a good day, I'm not gonna lie. We've caught a lot of fish. No, no, no giants, but caught some fish. Got a little large mouth right there. Boom. There we go. Let's get it back, catch another one. They're munching, we're gonna keep catching. Thought I'd see my line running that time. I wasn't positive, but I was like, that yeah, looks like my line's running. It was. Well, that is it, guys. We did pretty good down lake. Once we got up lake, definitely slowed down. Uh, I did start crappie fishing for a little bit. No luck with that. I did catch a little perch. Uh, that was pretty cool, but uh, we're headed back to the ramp. We're gonna call it a night. It's uh, 3.30. We're trying to get out of here before that traffic starts piling up over there on a on I-40. So, awesome day. I, I really didn't expect us to do that good. We caught a lot of smallmouth. Uh, nothing huge. We did catch that 17-incher. That was a pretty good fish. He caught a 17-incher for his big fish as well, smallmouth. So, overall, really good day. It was a Ned rig day. I mean, when's it not though? That thing always gets ate. Those those bass just crush it, especially the smallmouth. They love that Ned rig. The largemouth do too. So if they're gonna eat it, I'm gonna throw it. I threw some, I threw the jerk bait. I caught some fish on a jerk bait today. Uh, I caught a small largemouth, a couple a little white bass. And uh, let's see, what else did we? we got, yeah, that's I think that's all we caught them on was a jerk bait and a Ned rig today. So. But anyways, if you made it this far, guys, do me a favor. Please like this video. Please subscribe. Uh, I would really appreciate it. Help the channel keep growing, keep getting there. Like I said, it's such a slow process. But hey, we're out here. We're fishing. We're having fun. We're filming videos. So yeah, so I'm going to get back to the ramp. Hope you guys enjoyed that. And as always, I will see you all on the next one. Peace.